as we begin the training segment for the bar menu, refer to your training booklet under Basic Bar Menu. We will be designing menu items for bottled beer, well liquor, call liquor, and specialty drinks. Our training bar menu example is necessarily small because of the large number of brands and types of liquor that can potentially be, be served in a bar. You can make the bar menu larger or smaller to meet the needs of your restaurant or bar. First, let's place a submenu button for bar because we're going to be putting our bar items on a menu below the main food menu. If your primary business is a bar, then probably you'll want to design many of these items closer to the top of the menu so that your servers won't have to navigate down through several menus. Let's press F9 to display the component palette and the alignment palette. Uh, we're going to be placing a sub-menu button and we'll put that right over the top of hamburger meal deal. We'll be arranging our buttons later during the uh, tips and shortcuts section of the training so that the, the menu will look good when we're finished. Our caption is bar and we will not use a product code for this button because all of our items will be on a lower section of the menu. So press F9 to go to the run mode now and then click the bar button to go to the screen that we'll be using for setting up our bar items. For all of our bar menu we'll be using the conventional menu features in point of success. That means that these menu items can be defined using point of success standard or point of success premium. So the first item on our bar menu is bottled beer. So let's press F9 to go into the design mode and then we'll be placing a submenu button on this screen and the caption is bottled beer. Save that. We're not going to be using a product code here because our product codes will be assigned as the beer is selected. Press F9 to go to the run mode and then click bottled beer to go to the next menu level down to define our three types of bottled beer Bud Bud Light and Sam Adams. Press F9 to go into the design mode and these items on this level of the menu, the bar menu under bottled beer, will all be defined using an item button. So I'll click to put the item button down and type the name for the caption and then choose the product code, Budweiser Bottle. Save this. Let's do the next item button. Bud Light is the caption for this button and then we'll choose Bud Light. Save that. And then our final bottled beer selection is Sam Adams. So we'll put an item button down on the screen. And select the product code. And save it. Now we're finished with the bottled beer section of the bar menu.